Hey guys, it's me, Matt, making another video. And uh, today, it's a bit of a rant. Now, everybody knows, everybody has a couple in that friendship group that has a slightly odd uh, year gap between them. Now, I have, we, the squad, have that couple. He is also one of the. He is also a brother to one of the uh, to one of us. And um, but the rest of us see him like a brother because he's funny. And I've known him. And we've known him known him for a while. Now we have that uh, certain person. We have that couple with the huge age. With not really a huge age gap, but there is a quite a distant age gap between them. Now. There's the little British chavs. Yes, I said them, and I call them out. Chavs. That, uh, you know, <coughs> I've decided we're going to call him a fucking pedo. Because he's, yeah, this is this, this is disgusting. The rage trap is disgusting. Listen here, you little shits. It is not up to you. And I mean it's not up to you. Whether or not they, whether or not they can date. <coughs> See, they love each other, and there's nothing wrong with that. So what? There's an age gap. There's an age gap. Doesn't matter. What is your problem with it? Leave him alone. Stop harassing him. It is honestly becoming a serious problem for him and his brother. Like it all, it, like today it all kicked off because one of you decided to get mouthy, mouthy and say crap, you know, say shit about it, uh, say shit about him again. Stop harassing him. Leave them be. If they're happy together, they're happy together. They shouldn't be taking shit from you. And anyway, why would they want to take shit from you? They could ignore you anyway. Uh, but that's the problem. You've got to carry it on. And carry it on, and carry it on, and carry it on, and carry it on. And it's upsetting him, and it's pissing him off, and it's really, really, really getting on his nerves. All of you who are calling him a pedo, leave him be. All of him, all of you that are slagging him off to his girlfriend, leave him be. Because one day I can see all of you getting your crap little heads kicked in by the person, by a person who, by God knows who, but one day it's all going to come and slap your karma's going to come and ram it right up your ass, and you're all going to you're all going to end up feeling sorry for yourselves because that's what you are. You're feeling sorry for yourselves. And by feeling sorry for yourselves, you have to go and take your stupidity, your ignorant and bigoted opinions, and ram it down his throat when he doesn't want to take it. So, leave him alone, like I said. Because you deal with one of us, you deal with all of us. Yeah. And if you watch this, I don't care if you make fun of me for making this video. I don't care. Leave him alone. Leave her alone. Stop slagging him off to his girlfriend. They're happy together. I'm happy for him. We're all happy for him. You should be too. Because you never know, one day you might be in a similar, situa similar situation and everybody might be harassing you. And you will have no friends. None of you will know each other. None of you will even care about each other anymore. So please, just leave him the fuck alone. Before something bad happens.